for the Civil Party. As you are aware, uh, Honourable Senator Moses Tamula is the party leader of uh, Ford Kenya. Ford Kenya is the only surviving Second Liberation Party in Kenya. And there have been attempts to hold up this party with the intention of giving it out to those who think we need to return Kenya to a single party state. Now, what prompted the events of today? Remember, on the 8th of June, the Registrar of Political Parties had issued a Gazette notice, the effect of which was to invite views of the public on the question as to whether the Registrar of Political Parties should accede to the request made by two saboteurs, Wafula uh, Omnyenyi and Seli Simiu, who had uh, attempted a coup on the party. If that Gazette notice had gone on, it would have uh, eventually seen to the removal of the lawfully elected uh, officials of Fort Kenya party, including the party leader of the Senator uh, Moses Watango. However, upon receipt of our complaint on the impropriety being perpetrated through that office, the Registrar of Political Parties wrote a letter to the two factions yesterday in which she indicated that she will not deal with the matter any further because she has noticed the discrepancies, especially on the part of the saboteurs, in an effort to unlawfully alter the leadership of that political party. The registrar therefore decided and communicated to the two factions that they resolve the issues within the internal party mechanisms of Fort Kenya. And as far as we're concerned, the only proceedings pending before the internal party mechanism of Fort Kenya are disciplinary proceedings against these two saboteurs, which proceedings they intended to countermand by their decision to unlawfully alter the party leadership of uh, the, the society. Now, this morning again, the Registrar of Political Parties has written to the two factions, indicating that the Gazette notice that she had issued on the 8th of June has now been recalled. So as far as we are concerned, and bearing in mind the legal effect of that Gazette notice, for Kenya still in the hands of the party leaders who had been lawfully elected by the members. And the party leader right now is Honorable Senator Moses Wintang. We will now have uh, the party continue with its uh, own disciplinary mechanism against these two saboteurs and the supporters.